Hello everyone, today I played around with dry ice, specifically super cool cryofluid, a substance made of isopropyl alcohol and dry ice. We froze a water balloon, gummy bears, an egg, an old workbook, and a marshmallow. Here are the clips! Alright, the balloon. Alright, let's see how that works out. I'm gonna take these and see how they're doing. They appear to be uh, starting to fuse together. We're gonna leave it in there for a lot longer though. We'll see if that balloon freezes. That'll be cool. Okay, so we put a marshmallow in that's currently being frozen. Half of the balloon froze, and here we go with attempt two. Gummy bears. Three, two, one. Oh, oh my god, bears. they shattered. They completely shattered. That's awesome. Let's see if the wood does it. Nah, the wood doesn't do it, but the gummies did. Completely shattered. Wow. It's chunks of it everywhere. That's awesome. All right, so here is the water balloon. The outside is frozen, but you can see a bubble on the inside, so it's just a shell of ice currently. Oh, it peeled off. We have a water ball. Well, this is unexpected. <laughs> we have a literal orb of, oh, it broke. But it's literally an orb of ice. With water on the inside. Alright, I'm gonna throw this thing. <laughs> that is awesome. Alright, so this is how thick it got. It's not too thick, but it's pretty thick. Alright. Oh, the egg! Whoa. Okay, I'm gonna crack this open. Looks like it expanded and broke open. Don't hold it over the Nope, doesn't even work. Um, I'm, I don't know if this is going to work or not, taking my glove off. Break it with the hammer. No, we want to dissect it, though. We're going to need to break it with the hammer. All right. All right. Hold up. Ready? Oh god. Oh my god, it froze. Oh wow. Oh. <laughs> what? Okay, the yolk is Is it really cold? It's it's cold, but it's not frozen. We should have left it longer. It's nah, still cold. But, wow. <laughs> That's awesome. Alright, I'm gonna throw that away now. Alright, so we kept the marshmallow in there for pretty long. And now we're going to smack it, my prediction. Is that it's frozen on the outside, not so frozen on the inside. Here we go. Three, two, one. It shattered. Looks like it was frozen uh, pretty much on the inside, too. That didn't. But yeah. I attached a hammer with a string to a Sunny D bottle. I'm going to fill the Sunny D bottle with dry ice and put it in the pool. See what happens. Maybe it'll explode or something cool. It wasn't heavy enough with the sledgehammer alone, so we've added a wedge to make it heavier to be able to submerge it. I submerged it with the dry ice inside, but the cap is leaking, so all of it is uh, going out. Uh, so it looks like it's not being able to build enough pressure, but it is building a bit. We're going to keep monitoring it. So as you can see, it uh, ruptured at uh, one point. Not a very violent explosion, but uh, it is definitely 
it's uh, leaking out from one end of it, which is pretty cool. So I'd, I'd call that a bit of a success. So it's not the cap. Yeah, it's not the cap. Wow. All right. Unfortunately, the workbook did not freeze or anything. It just got wet. Anyways, thanks for watching.